The purpose of doing the maze test was to separate individuals who had superior psychic abilities and separate them from just everyone else. There's only been one individual who's been able to make it out and remain themselves completely when coming back into this reality from that place. But everyone else, they were not able to find their way out. For example, there was one subject, Jenny, and we had her do the maze test, and since she did not make it out in time, 90% of her mental awareness is still trapped in that maze. She's conscious in this reality that we're in, but she only has 10% of her awareness here. She has most likely permanently now gone insane. And it's unfortunate for her and everyone else because as I said, we've only had one successful case. But this research is so vital and important. And I regret nothing. Wake up. Wake up. Excellent. It's okay, study. Study. Your head might still be a bit woozy. You were kind of uh, in a state for the past few days, and um, we had to give you some things to help you along, but. Uh, I'm glad to see that you're awake. Um, well, today, it's been quite some time since our last um, testing session, so today will be about seeing how much your powers have progressed. And I know you've been doing lots of training on this, but um, it's always good to check in and see where you're at with your abilities. So that is what today is about. And since you are finally back with us mentally and um, with your health, today is a perfect day for conducting another test session with you. So, 
you know, that before we get into the more tests that are specifically to test your abilities, um, I'm just going to do a bit of a checkup, especially considering that you have not been doing so well the past few days, as I mentioned. But I think you should be capable of displaying your gifts today. So, I'm first going to just check your heartbeat. Can you take some deep breaths for me? Excellent. Everything sounded quite normal. And I think throughout this particular testing session, I will routinely take your heartbeat just to make sure that you are stable throughout the whole session. Now let me just jot down that. Your heart sounded all right. like to test your eyes and make sure that they are working and your senses are with you. All right, so I have a little light and I'm just going to ask you to follow this light. Very good. Great job. And I'm just gonna take a bit of a closer look. pupils to make sure that they're dilating as they should. The other side. Again, I just want to take a couple notes. As per usual, I just want to do a simple 
brain scan to make sure that you are currently hooked up to our systems as today we will be monitoring, monitoring the activity in your brain uh, throughout the whole session and particularly through a few of the tests today. Alright, so this is painless, quick, simple, and nothing to it. So just relax. side as well. Excellent. And let me just check on my little device. Make sure that you're hooked up because I can see your brain activity on this as well. Perfect. And you seem to be relatively calm at the moment, which is perfect in where you should be because we want you to be. Calm while we conduct these tests. All right. Now, there'll be three tests today, and one you have done many times and passed without fail many times, and the purpose of doing it again is to act kind of as a constant to make sure that you still at least have the abilities that you had before to the same degree, and two of the tests will be new, relatively, and we thought that a shorter test might be best since your health has not been 100% lately. So, I've already taken your heartbeat or listened to it. So after this first test, which is the one that you've already done before, I will check it again just to make sure. Um, it's either constant or if there are any changes. All right. Well. The first test, which you have done before, is a Zener card test. And as you know, we have five different cards. One has a square. One has a circle. One has wavy lines. And a star. So, what I'm going to do is pick randomly out of these five one card. So, one shape. And I'm not going to tell you 
which card or which shape I picked. Using your abilities, you are to tell me what shape out of the five that I picked. So, nothing to it. And you've done it so many times now, I'm sure you can handle it. So, I'm going to pick a random shape, a random car. this test. Now, just relax and focus your mind and your energy on this card. Try and see what it is. What shape Relax your mind. Focus on nothing but this card. Just relax your mind. And what shape is it? Again, shall we? Okay. I've picked the second card. Like before, relax your mind. Focus on this card. Focus on this card and see what shape is on it. Relax your mind. Relax. Relax. Is the shape perfect? The wavy lines. Why don't we try this one more time? the final card and the final shape. Relax your mind. Focus on this card. Focus on this card and nothing else. Relax your mind. Relax. Relax. Relax your mind and focus. And what is the shape? Perfect again, a square. See, there was really nothing to that test. You're such a at it by now. 
Let me just mark down that you passed the first test. Before I take your heartbeat again, I just want to ask you about something. About a year ago, we had you take the uh, maze test. You might not. Remember, it was a long time ago. But, um, we never quite finished talking about your experience with that. And there's something that we never told you. You, so far, out of the many that we have sent through that maze are the only one who has made it out so how you choose to interpret that information I'll leave up to you Do you still dream about the maze and the people there? Occasionally. Then it hasn't quite left your system yet. But with time it should. The others, I'm afraid, are... Well... They'll never get out of there entirely. But just know that you are incredible. You were the only one who made it out of that maze. It just shows that we were right in picking you. You should be proud of yourself, but I thought I would just bring it up and ask. Now, like I said, I'm going to listen to your heart again. beating a little bit faster than it was before, but that's to be expected. It's still stable, relatively. Great. So, the next test I have here, hang on one moment. Similar to the Zener card test, I have five color tubes. There's yellow, purple,
green and blue and like the Zener card test I'm going to pick one of these colors and I'm going to ask that you close your eyes and try to see the color that I picked and then you'll tell me which it is that you have seen so close your eyes perfect so I have now picked a color See the color that I picked. Try and see the color that I picked. What color is it? Relax your mind. And open your eyes. What color did I pick? Perfect. Green. Green was the first color that I picked. I knew you would be able to do this test. Was it clear or was it just a faint hint of color? Okay. Now, we'll do this one more time. So close your eyes. Perfect. Now, I've picked a second. your mind 
juicy. Purple. Perfect. Excellent. You are amazing. You do know that, right? Far above everyone else that we've seen and your abilities, so good for you. Take some more notes. the final test. It's a little complicated. People with superior abilities, like how you appear to be, can sometimes transport themselves mentally. So their physical body remains where they are, but mentally they can go anywhere they can imagine. They can smell things in this place, hear things in this place, and it'll feel like you're there. This is something that I've been able to do myself, and it's certainly interesting. Now, as this is your first time attempting to do this, I will describe the place for you, but if this is an ability that you possess, it will feel like you're there. So, just need you to close your eyes. Good. Now, listen to my voice and focus on my voice as I describe. A field. A field. Just after all the snow from winter has melted, leaving the grass yellowed. You can see trees surrounding this field. You can hear the wind, and you can hear a stream off in the distance. You can feel the grass. see water, and you can see the sky, so blue. You don't want to leave this place, but 
You must leave this place behind and wake up. Transport yourself back. Getting there is just half of it, but coming back is the hard part. Now, transport yourself back. Come back. And open your eyes. Were you there? Excellent. You are truly amazing. And we are so fortunate to have you. Now, I'm just going to listen to your heart once more. Excellent. You seem to have um, actually calmed down from before. Well, I will just take my final notes and then I will let you get some sleep. You did an amazing job today. Truly impressive. And like I said, we'll get let you get some rest and hopefully we will uh, get a chance to meet again and I'll have you take some more tests. All right. a pleasure seeing you today, and I will see you when I do next. Bye-bye.